Okay, today we're just going to have a look at um, doing a neurological assessment on Lockie to um, sort of thing that we do when we've got pain that refers from the cervical spine or we've got pain that's radiating down the arm um, or a loss of strength or a loss of sensation. So we're going to do myotome testing and dermatome testing and also reflex testing. I'll start with the myotomes. So I'm just going to come around the back um, and I'm just going to get Lockie to press his shoulders up towards the roof and relax. So looking at strength there for C4, bend your elbows, lock in, pushing your elbows out to the side. So that's deltoid, that's C5. Um, bring your hands to 90 degrees, hands up. I want you to push up against my hands. So that's C6, that's um, your biceps. Um, turn your hands over for me, lock in, and push down. So triceps, that's C7. The next one is looking at thumb abduction, that's um, C8. Push up, C8, and then lumbricals, so um, is T1. So hold your hand there, don't let me pull your fingers apart. And if you can break that easily, there's um, a loss of strength or a loss of conduction through that T1 nerve root. Now we're going to go through the dermatome testing for the um, cervical spine. So basically, C5 is, you've got to make sure you've got your hands in the right position, so hands turned up and out. C5 on the deltoid, C6 on the thumb, C7 on the middle finger, C8 on the lateral border of the hand, and T1 on the forearm above the line of the wrist. Okay, so we'll do that again. C5 there, C6, C7, C8, and T1. And yeah, if you compare sides, so you, you compare to make sure that it's... Um, is that the same on both sides? How does that feel on the side on each side? And then there, there. And C4 is actually up on, on the top of the shoulder there. And you can even do C3 up on the top of the, the upper trapezius.